and here we go again. This demonstration I'll start off with a question. Have you ever wanted to record the audio that comes across your speakers on your computer or an audio from a show or maybe something you've listened to or watched on your computer and you think I could do with a copy of that? How would you do it? Windows can't do it because uh, it hasn't got the facilities to record what you hear. How, so we, we can sort that out very simply I'll just open up another web page here and we go to a site which uh, it's called Softronic if I just paste that in there it's called Softronic now Softronic maybe haven't had the best reputation in the past with malware and all that sort of stuff but it seems they've cleaned, cleaned the site up they've cleaned their act up and they've got on with just providing software for people and although I was very tentative at first to uh, try to get the software I wanted from there it did work out okay so we'll just zoom to Softronic and that will tell us that it's um, a recorder for Windows it's a free PC audio recorder this you can record your Skype calls your audio from music from shows from whatever you watch on the computer or listen to on the computer you can record it and with straightforward we'll, we'll go to the page and it will show us basically what it's all about here and it tells you what you can do record calls game audio videos and more it's very basic it's one of the the cons for it the pros are uh, choose the file quality and size it's easy to use it's very basic is the download okay so let's click the download button and we get the choice of sign-in now I don't like signing in either with Facebook or Google Plus because I end up with loads of junk on the computer that people have sent me email ah oh, you know you know what it's like you don't need me to tell you so if you click this alternative download in other words you don't have to sign in for this one um, I'll just shut that bit of music off before it starts because that's a bit overbearing and deafening there we are stop that because that does get very loud uh, so it's pre-recorded set up I'll save the file there we are save the file matter of seconds and that's done so I won't I won't run that uh, soundtrack on the KMP because it's horrible right and that's it we're finished with Softronic so we go to our download folder and there is the pro there is the file that we've just downloaded okay so first thing I'm gonna do is get my malware to give it a quick scan only takes but a moment there we are custom scan it's checking its updates its scan operation item scanned one threats so it's pretty much clean I have a lot of faith in malware bytes just recently because it has uh, gives you warnings when you go on the screen of unsafe sites so it's good okay so we know it's clean let's double click on it and we get all the audio that's coming out and it says welcome to free PC audio recorder wizard setup okay click on that except the agreement. let's have a quick look that there's nothing horrible in there there is it's lovely colors different areas have different colors uh, there is nothing to say in there that it's going to install any other software or any other junk mail or malware or anything at all it's just straightforward um, basically it gives you a license to use the product as is you can't complain if it doesn't work on your computer it does give you warnings about copyright material as well which is very important um, not everything that you get off the internet is free to use and broadcast or rebroadcast can use it for your own personal use only so just bear that in mind anyway we we'll click next we've read that it's going to install program files by 86 free PC audio recorder and away it goes install it it's not the biggest is it not the biggest file so we'll take the view the help view out and just launch the recorder and this is it this is the recorder close the uh, thing it's not massive is it it's not the biggest in the world so let's take a look at it let's click on file and let's have a look at the settings right the settings in this are quite simple auto run with Windows is off because I don't want it starting up every time I use Windows useless um, use of memory uh, hotkey don't need a hotkey for it uh, be an icon on the desk uh, record input voice 
from a microphone so if you want to make your own recording with a microphone you can do that you record output voice from the computer and that's the one I have ticked and that's one that I don't know if that's default or because I obviously looked at this before record both in and out voice so if you're doing a conversation on Skype you want two sides of the conversation you can click that button so there we are save path is usually you can change that to whatever you want so if I change that to um, We'll put it on the desktop, I think. So it's going to save the output voice on from the output from the computer, and it's going to save it onto my desktop, so I'll be able to get to it. Separated by a month, separated by a day. Not bothered about that because I'll be able to look at it straight away. A sample rate. Now you have got various things there. Obviously, the smaller it is, the less room it'll take up on your computer, but the quality will go down. I'm going to leave it as set at 48,000 um, bits per second, I think it is. And the bit rate, 128. You can go up to 320, 256, 224. I think 128 is quite normal. If you want a bit um, better quality than that, you can click on. But remember, it takes up more resources and it's more likely to trip over and... Uh, maybe not get everything that you want so we'll leave it as set you can also donate I always p uh, point this out if you decide you like this program and you feel that it's going to be really valuable to you then click on the donate button and make a small donation it, has to, it doesn't have to be a million pound a time or hundred thousand pound a time or even a pound a time you give them what you can afford and what you think it is worth to you Bearing in mind, I bought um, a program very similar to this one time, and it cost me twenty-four ninety-nine or something like that for a very similar program. Okay, there was other bits to it as well, so twenty-four ninety-nine, which is what thirty dollars. Yeah, give if you gave them half of that, even fifteen dollars or fifteen pound, whatever your currency is, I'm sure they'd be grateful, and it does mean that this sort of program will continue to go on people will always be making this sort of thing so that's the setup very straightforward very simple there's nothing complicated about it okay so maybe now we need to find something to record <laughs> if any observant users will see martin U luther king suppose i just wanted a copy of this martin luther king speech just for your club your society or your your um, your social event whatever it is and you just wanted a copy of it so you could quote from it let's take a look how to do that first of all we'll set this um, we'll set this running start we'll go to see Martin and we'll let them have a few so uh, even though we face the difficulties of today and tomorrow I still have a dream yes. it is a dream deeply rooted in the American dream I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of its creed. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. There we go. And, and with that, I'll leave it because that is one of those speeches that you can get engrossed with and it's... Um, uh, it's, it's inspiring to say the least so there we go we'll stop it at that uh, we have 52 seconds okay now um, I can close that now don't need it open but if I look here on the desktop we have a file which is created which is where we asked to do it let's have a look at this file and here we go um, so even though we face the difficulties of today and tomorrow I still have a dream so there we are this is uh, yeah that's it that's the recording and we have recorded it we now have a copy of the speech simply click on it and uh, Martin Luther King speech so here we are we have the speech we have the nice desktop icon so we can uh, we can start it going whenever we want and that's all there is to it just to reiterate, if we go into the internet and we type in our uh, our um, chosen website, oh, there we go, which is softronic.com. I'll put this up at the end of the uh, demonstration. I'll put the address up, and you can go there and have a look at it yourselves. 
Thank you very much for watching this demonstration. I hope it's been useful to you and I hope you found it informative and that you'll go and visit Softronic, download the audio recorder and make a donation to it as well because it's one of those things which, uh, even if you never use it every day, it's handy to have on the computer. I hope you've enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel which is Howard L. Hall at YouTube. And if you've liked this video or enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up. Simple as that. And if you want to leave a comment, if you have uh, other things you'd like to say about it, then please leave a comment and I'll try to answer you if I can. Bye for now.